Hello friends, welcome to Desert View Studio. My name is Virginia. In this tutorial, I am making flower box using Jenga blocks. To complete this project, you will need a total of 131 Jenga blocks. Other tools and supplies that you will need are electric sander or a sheet of sandpaper, a miter box and saw, painter tape, any color of your choice, and also wood glue. Step 1. Glue 6 blocks together in this pattern. You will need a total of 8 panels to complete all 4 sides. Step 2. Glue 8 blocks together in this direction. You will need a total of 8 panels. And lastly, step 3. This is for the base. You will need to glue 2 panels of 7 blocks. This is also part of the base. Glue 5 blocks together in this direction. After that, you will cut the block at the green mark. Glue all 3 pieces together in this direction. Next, you will assemble all four panels in this pattern. And these are the five panels that we will need for this project. Using the speckling to fill in the gaps is optional. I use the electric sander to smooth the surface. Dust off and clean surface well. After that, I tape in section as you are seeing here. I paint this area in black. Repeat on the other three panels. Allow all pieces to dry before moving on to the next step. After that, I apply the second color. Once the paint is completely dry, I sand down as you are seeing here. I also paint the base in black. Next, I assemble all the pieces together. And here is the close-up look of the flower box. There are gaps at the seam due to the imperfection size of the Jenga blocks. However, the end result still came out very nice. These are the iceberg white roses from my front yard. And here it is, the complete project. This flower box is perfect in any corner or any room in the house. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Until my next video, bye for now.